Emily thinks I work too much. Now apparently, at least according to Andrew, Delilah thinks the same thing about him. She also thinks he works too much. Now I don't think I actually work that much at all. I don't actually think I work enough, but Emily thinks I work too much. So today I'm only allowed three hours of work. So you wake up at 10? Yeah, I woke up at 7. Oh, okay, good. Cool day. We gotta get there, like, almost right when it opens. Right, right when it opens. Well, because it's gonna be busy. Today. The moment it opens, we gotta get there. It's gonna be busy today. So, at this point, you're probably wondering why the vlog has been in black and white for, like, the past week. There's a reason for that. You see, about a week or two ago, I came to the conclusion that I think the feature film should be in black and white. It is something that I adore. Some of my favorite films are in black and white. I love black and white cinematography, especially Elia Kazan and Orson Welles and Howard, uh, not Howard Hughes, Howard Hawks and George Kikor. I think there is something timeless about black and white that you really don't get in color. So the vlog, sort of, is a chance to practice black and white, to practice what the feature film would look like. At least that was the idea. You see, yesterday I met with the whole crew, and this was one of the decisions we had to make as a crew. I guess I could technically make an executive decision, but this wasn't the time or place to make that sort of decision, so I asked the whole crew, and um, I'm the only one that wanted to shoot in black and white. Now, am I disappointed by this decision? Yeah. Do I still think black and white would be better? Yeah, but it's not my film. It's our film and I trust my crew a lot more than I trust myself. So perhaps in spite, out of stubbornness or for whatever reason, this vlog for however long is going to continue to be in black and white. Now this won't in any way change the content of the vlog or anything that I do on the vlog. It's just going to be in black and white because I love black and white cinematography. I think it's beautiful. I, I don't know why everyone doesn't always shoot in black and white. If I had the option, I think everything I ever shot would be in black and white, but I don't. That's fine. It's fine. So for the time being, this is going to be in black and white because um, it's my vlog and I can do whatever I want. I decided to go to the pool today. When we got here, almost all of the seats were already taken. But people weren't actually sitting in the seats. People had just put towels and then left. And this was at 9.30 in the morning. Pretty early. I mean, it was hot. It's very hot today. But people just put them down and left, which is just kind of a crummy thing to do, I think. Now, as I said, we were able to find seats, but only literally found the last two seats. And it's not that there's anything wrong with saving seats, like, I get it. But, like, no one was down here. They just put the towels, and then all of them left. And then the other thing is no one actually swims in the pool. Most people just sit around the pool, which I just... I don't really understand. Like, if you're gonna go to the pool, go to the pool. I don't just get sitting around near the pool. If you're just gonna sit outside, just go do that at home. Why come to the pool? But we're here, and it's really nice out. We have now been at the pool for five, four or five hours. We've been there for a while. And Emily's just having me come up because she wants a seltzer. And that's swollen on the ground. We're just waiting for my parents to get here, but they have like a garage sale thing today because I guess they're uh, trying to sell all of the crap that was in their basement. I mean, I don't think they actually sold very much, but I'm glad they're getting it out of their basement. I think everything they don't sell, they're just gonna take to Goodwill, which I think they should've just done that in the first place because most of that stuff's trash, but I guess when it comes to garage sales, it's sort of all trash, so not really my decision to make, but they're getting rid of old stuff from their basement and uh, should be over within like, an hour or two? I mean, usually they say they'll be here around like one and then I'll end up getting here till three. So, uh, I don't know, we'll see. Emily, uh, she finished her seltzer, so I have to find a 
lunchbox so I can bring around multiple seltzers at once. Because if I just bring down one seltzer, they have to come up like every 20 minutes. If I bring about just more seltzers, then uh, I guess they'll get warm. So I am bringing ice packs. Is four enough? Is four too many? Maybe just two. Maybe just two ice packs. And uh, I have to get uh, a seltzer. Oh, another one of those. And cider. And it's still everywhere. It's great. Seltzer, one cider. This is a local Ashenelm, pretty good. This one is not local, but still pretty good. As far as, oh, there's a, there's a fork in this lunchbox. Not great. All right, put these in here. Yeah, I mean, this is probably good. It is now 5.30. We have been at the pool for eight plus hours. It's a pretty intense day. I mean, relaxing, of course, you're by the pool. I, I did work, technically. I just worked on the script, so it's not like real work, I, I don't think. But it was good. Sophia came, we swam, had a good time. Now we're going to Big Lug with them, and then we're gonna hang out at their house. Apparently there's some sort of bonfire going on. So far today has been a pretty good day.